Francis, and I'm here to talk to you about the adjustable setup of the Meerkat. So the Meerkat can be used in both anterior and posterior settings. So why might we select each one? Well, you might look at a more anterior position if the child's more new to upright standing or perhaps needs a bit more support. Because in that anterior position, you've got the firm support here at the front. You can also quite easily change the foot plates round from anterior to posterior, so it's quite easy to change between the two positions. So with that, in anterior, you've got this firm support, but you've also got a lot of the support at the front of the meerkat, perhaps getting in the, in the way of a child accessing a, a table, for example, so you have got the use of the tray. To progress a child, though, as that child becomes more confident in standing and the skill and develop of their trunk and core stability improves, you would want to look to turn them around into posterior positioning. And that puts more of this soft support at the front. It also opens up the child, so it allows them to interact more closely at a table, such as in a classroom setting, and gets them ready for having that lack of support in front of them when we're looking at progressing those next steps, that standing ability, and that progression towards walking. And that's how you'd use the meerkat in both anterior and posterior settings.